Hello, welcome to News Update. National Union of Road Transport Workers Legal State Council's Chairman Al Haji Musili Akin Sonia, also known as MC Oloma, has announced the withdrawal of members of the State Council, including himself from the national body. This is coming a few hours after the union's headquarters suspended Akin Sonia for alleged insubordination. The Senate said Abubakar Malami, Rotimi Amechi, Chris Ngigi, and other political appointees believed to be interested in elective offices will not be able to participate in the All Progressives Congress primaries, expected to begin in May unless they resign. This follows the rejection of the Electoral Act Amendment Bill by the Senate on Wednesday. A number of passengers on an Ibadan Lagos train have had no choice but to disembark from the train they were traveling on after it ran out of fuel at an unknown location. President Vladimir Putin insists Russia is meeting its obligations on energy supplies and is not to blame for price rises following its invasion of Ukraine. He blamed the miscalculations of the West. Mali said it will investigate the disappearance of several Mauritanians on its territory caused by regular Malian forces. This has caused a diplomatic row between the two West African countries. A virtual gallery to showcase Mali's cultural history has been launched, featuring tens of thousands of Timbuktu's ancient manuscripts. The collection, called Mali Magics, also captured Malian culture beyond the manuscript. It was put together by Google along with local and international partners. Nigeria International Asisat Oshuala has signed a new contract with La Liga and Women's Champions League holders Barcelona. The 27-year-old forward will now remove the Spanish giants until the end of 2023-2024 campaign. A Ghanaian businessman is reportedly seeking to become the first African owner of English Premier League club Chelsea with a bid of $3.1 billion. Bernard Antwi Bosiako, popularly known as Chairman Wutumi, is a gold mine owner politician relatively unknown in the sporting world. And that's the news update. You can get more from POS TV Network. Isn't the details currently showing on your screen?